my mentor taught me about Oscar Grant. And my young, at 17 year old, 17 years old, my focus was basketball. I wasn't, I wasn't, you know, fully awake. You know, I had the warnings that my mother always would give me about calling, you know, when you out. And, you know, don't let the street light come on before you get home. You know, that, 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 that talk. When I was 17, I was part of a, a poetry slam team. And my coach came into the practice room. He was just really distraught to the point of tears. Um, and he had, he had told us what happened uh, when the verdict came out. And I felt so upset that I didn't even know what was going on. If y'all remember, that same day was the same day people were waiting to see what team LeBron James wanted to go to. And I happened to be distracted. I was one of those people distracted, tuning in to that when there's something happening right here at home that I had no idea of. That's what, that's what, that was when I woke up seeing my coach. That was the individual in the house that was cleaning. And he didn't force us to wake up. He just, he just showed his compassion of what was going on. Last year, I was I was honored to be able to just host and facilitate this space. Last year, one of my best friends murdered, unarmed, by the police. He always told me to keep speaking. He said, "Keep doing your thing. Keep 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 your dream alive." You know. As a kid, I always wanted to just speak and share. Um, I am a father as well. You know, I have two little girls. So to be to be um, asked to facilitate to facilitate this, it really means more than y'all can ever imagine. Because while, you know, doing the New Year celebrations, every year, I look forward to this. Every year, I remember, keep going in, speaking truth to power. Feel tough. Sometimes I feel alone. Sometimes I feel you stampeding with me. But I'm taking every, I want to encourage all of us to take every advantage of life. Don't just think you live in your life. Life is living you. Life is living you. No, this whole planet is waiting for you. Waiting for you. I want to acknowledge the babies that are still here. The most conscious beings in this space right now. Take advantage of every opportunity and keep creating. Spread courage. It's just, it's more contagious than fear. Keep spreading courage. The adults, you know, mommies and daddies and grandpas and grandmas, they look at you and they, they appreciate and adore the fact that you can run around freely. Cause you don't, you, 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 you don't have no worries about what, what we think of. So we want to remind you and encourage you to all the babies that are here. Keep spreading that courage. Keep spreading that courage. So I'm going to go ahead and um, we get off this stage. We got it. Oh, snap. You need some time? You need time to sit up? All right. All right. What do we do?